Now this coral here is a beautiful green corella. Now this coral was introduced into this aquarium about five or six years ago as a tiny little piece and it's since then, then grown and spread absolutely enormously. These sorts of corals are also very easy to propagate. You can actually propagate them by running a razor blade from the mouth out and then the mouth up. So then you're actually splitting it into two. It's more preferable if you can actually snap it off to move them apart, but they will often um, um, reproduce quite easily on the rock itself. But whatever you do, if you're going to cut these sorts of corellas to propagate them, don't do it out of the water, because if you cut them, they can actually squirt um, and cotty into your eye, which I've actually seen happen. So um, they're very easy to propagate. They're, they're, also, they're a coral where you can put them pretty much anywhere you want in the aquarium. The same piece will survive quite well in more water flow, in less water flow, in a lot of light, in less light. They're a very adaptive coral. Um, they really are a good choice for anyone, be it beginner or advanced. In this aquarium you'll also see blue, you'll also see red, you'll see green, you'll also see your fluffies, which is your the big elephant ear looking one up here. Um, these sorts of corals, um, they're called morphs, often known as morphs. Just very easy to keep, um, very easy to propagate, have very, very few um, um, criterias to meet. Um, you're really a perfect coral for anyone.